Imagine a fighter jet so advanced, its communication system could rewrite the rules of aerial combat. But what if that same cutting-edge technology creates a massive, unforeseen challenge for NATO's unified operations? Dive into the hidden complexities of the Gripen's data link and discover why this technological marvel is a double-edged sword for the Alliance. Unlock the secrets of the Gripen fighter jet's game-changing data link system. This video will demystify the technology that's redefining aerial communication while exposing the critical challenges it poses for NATO's interconnected defense framework. Gain a deeper understanding of how this single piece of tech is shaping the future of Allied air power. What if a fighter jet could see what no one else could? What if its eyes and ears reached far beyond the battlefield, connecting pilots, drones, and command centers in ways the enemy could never imagine? Meet the Gripen's data link, the invisible thread that turns this Swedish fighter into a true force multiplier. Unlike traditional aircraft systems, this digital brain doesn't just gather information, it shares it in real time across multiple platforms, giving pilots situational awareness that was once science fiction. But here's the twist. Integrating this advanced technology into NATO operations isn't as simple as flipping a switch. While the Gripen's data link is a game changer in modern warfare, it comes with its own set of puzzles, encryption, compatibility, and national security protocols that make plug and play interoperability a massive challenge. So, how does Sweden's cutting edge system fit into a coalition of allies with different standards and legacy tech? That's where the real NATO challenge begins. Imagine if every pilot in the sky could share the same brain, instantly knowing where threats are, what allies are doing, and which targets matter most. That's essentially what a data link does. It's a shared consciousness, turning individual pilots into a perfectly coordinated team. For the Gripen, this isn't just theory. Its tactical data link allows it to transmit and receive critical battlefield information in real time. While it can interface with NATO systems like Link 16, the Alliance's standard for digital communication, Sweden's system has unique encryption and speed advantages, making its data flow incredibly secure and lightning fast. Picture this, a stealth UAV approaching undetected. The grip and spots it first and instantly shares its position across the network. Allies respond in seconds, neutralizing the threat before it even fully appears on conventional radar. This isn't just tech, it's battlefield supremacy, giving pilots a decisive edge. But even with this advantage, integrating such a powerful system into NATO's complex ecosystem is far from simple. That's where the interoperability puzzle begins. So, if the Gripen's data link is this revolutionary, why isn't everyone using it seamlessly across NATO forces? The answer lies in a complex web of technology. NATO members operate a mix of legacy platforms, proprietary systems, and varying encryption protocols. Simply connecting them isn't like plugging in a USB, it's more like teaching completely different languages to understand each other instantly in the heat of battle. This is where interoperability becomes mission critical. NATO has been working on standardization initiatives, including MIDS terminals and shared communication protocols to bridge these gaps. But even with these efforts, integrating Sweden's cutting edge system presents political, technical, and operational hurdles that go far beyond just hardware or software. Next, we'll uncover the solutions that could finally untangle this knot and what it means for the future of coalition warfare. The Gripen's data link isn't just a tool, it's a game changer for tactical decision making. Pilots no longer operate in isolation. Every piece of information, from enemy positions to mission updates, is shared instantly, creating a real-time battlefield picture that is nothing short of revolutionary. 
Imagine a fully networked air force where each aircraft, drone, and ground unit acts as a node in a single intelligent system. This networked approach amplifies NATO's operational effectiveness, allowing forces to respond faster, strike smarter, and minimize risk. Looking ahead, aerial warfare is evolving. Traditional dogfights are becoming less decisive, while secure, robust data links are becoming the backbone of air superiority. In this new era, the ability to share information safely and instantly may matter far more than the speed or firepower of a single jet. In other words, the future belongs to the forces that can think, see, and act as one, and the Gripen is showing NATO exactly how that future could look. So, what's the takeaway? The Gripen's data link is undeniably powerful, giving pilots unprecedented situational awareness and tactical advantage. But as we've seen, integrating it seamlessly across NATO is far from straightforward. The path forward involves bridging these gaps through middleware, standardization efforts, and advanced communication gateways. NATO's ongoing initiatives aim to ensure that cutting-edge systems like Gripen's can operate within a fully connected alliance without compromising security or efficiency. Looking ahead, the Gripen represents more than just a fighter jet. It's a glimpse into the future of a data-driven NATO. Forces that can share information instantly and act as one will define the next era of air combat. And for Sweden's Gripen, the mission is clear. Lead the way in building a truly interconnected alliance. The question isn't whether this future will arrive. It's whether we're ready, connect, coordinate, and dominate in the skies like never before. If you want to stay ahead of the latest fighter jet tech, NATO strategies, and next-gen aerial warfare, make sure to hit that subscribe button and join the Viper Jet Wing Squad. Don't forget to like, comment, and share your thoughts, because in the skies of tomorrow, knowledge is power.